The sounds that we are learning today are two different sounds that look different and are spelled differently, but they sound the same. And the sound is the ow sound. So when you kick your toe on a wall or you fall by accident and you say ow, that's the sound that we are learning today. So the words that I would have shown you in class, we're going to go through them. I want you to try and read it before I read it. So when, before I read a word, let's see if you can quickly read it before me even. About. Found. Shout. Sound. Cloud. Can you hear that owl sound? Bow. Allow. Bow again. Hour. Clown. Cow. And owl. Gown, flower, fowl, flower. Can you guess what kind of flower this is and what kind of flower that is? And then hour and ground. All right. So can you think of any more words with an owl sound? Try and say them out loud and when you get back to school, I want you to try and remember to tell me the different words that you thought of. In your pack, you've got a worksheet like this. You're just going to cut around the edges so that it fits into your English book nicely. And then the question asks you, use the words below to help you answer the riddles that follow. So you're going to read these riddles and then you can just write the word next to it in color. The first one says, what do you call a smelly chicken? Can you guess? Okay, that one is a fowl. So if someone smells, then sometimes you say, oh, you smell foul. Then B what do you call 60 minutes that belong to us? I think you know that one. C. What are soft feathers on the ground? D. What is the pretty part of a plant when it is made of the stuff from which you make bread? E. What do you call soil that has been in a grinder? That's, that one is ground. Then the next questions ask you, sort these words into two groups with the owl or w sound and the owl or a sound. So you can, we're not going to do it in our box, but you can color in all the words with the a w sound in green so just color over them and all the words with the a oh, uh, sound in red you can just color over them then B asks you write a sentence with two words from each list you made so two words that are colored in green and two words that are colored in red and then so you'll have four sentences all together that you can do in your book remember to write the date and the heading is phonics